Hello, I'm Susan Scurry with the marketing team at Print Audit, and today I'm going to demonstrate for you some of the powerful reporting features in Print Audit 6. Print Audit 6 provides a set of standard reports as well as the ability to create custom reports. Today I'm going to introduce the analysis reporting application and demonstrate how to run some of the standard reports that are available there. To begin, open the simple analysis reporting application within Print Audit 6. You can find this by going to your Windows Start menu. Looking in all programs, find the Print Audit 6 menu item, go into Reporting, and choose Simple Analysis Reporting. Before we begin creating a report, we're first going to take a look at the grouping feature in Print Audit 6. Print Audit 6 allows you to create user and printer reporting groups. You can use these groups to more easily report on different areas of your organization. For example, printers could be grouped by location or model or whether they are local or network, and users could be grouped by department or building. So to add, edit, or delete user reporting groups, first go to the Groups menu and select Edit User Groups. To add a new user group, click the Add button, give your group a name, and begin to add members to your group. To add multiple members to your group, hold down the control key while you select the usernames. When you are finished adding users, click the Select button and return to the Edit Group window. You will see here a complete list of names that you have selected. If you are satisfied with that list, press Save and your new group has been added to the list of user groups. Groups of printers can also be created by going to the Groups menu, open Edit Printer Groups, click the Add button to create a new group, give your group a name, and add printers to the group. Save your group and it will appear in the printer groups list. Once you have groups created, you can more easily create reports that will display data in a more concise format. So let's create a report now. Please go to the Reports menu and open Create Report. Then you'll select the Create a New Report icon and choose Build. In the Create a Report wizard, you can review a list of all the reports packaged in Print Audit 6. Review this list and notice that as you select a report, a brief description will appear in the right side window. Once you've selected a report that you'd like to run, click the Next button to advance to the next tab. In the Groups tab, you may now select any previously created reporting groups, such as we previously demonstrated. If no groups are selected, the report will include data from all printers and users in the database. Select Next to advance to the next tab. In the Parameters tab, you may choose to sort your data by selecting one of the parameters in the Sorting drop-down box. Then you may select your date range, and also change the number of decimal places used in costs that are displayed in the report. Once you've configured your parameters, select Next to go to the next tab. Finally, you may enter a title or subtitle for your report. To save the report for future use, select Save and Build. To build the report without saving, just select the Build button. All reports appear by default with a cover page. This page is there to remind you of the selections you made when building the report. This feature, however, can be disabled by looking in the Reports menu and selecting the Create Cover Page item. When the icon is displayed next to this item, that means the default cover page setting is on. When the icon is not displayed, the setting is off and the cover page will not appear in future reports. Use the page forward and backward arrows to navigate through the different pages of your report. From this point, you may choose to print or export your report data. To print the report, simply select the printer icon in the menu. 
To export the report, go to the Reports menu and choose Export Report. Select a location, enter a file name, and select the file type. Print Audit 6 can export reports in text, HTM, PDF, and CSV file formats. Now that you've seen a demonstration of Print Audit's simple analysis reporting, try running some reports of your own. To learn even more about the powerful reporting tools in Print Audit 6, please refer back to our library of recorded tutorials and see the other helpful video demonstrations.